Most dangerous disaster in Colombia, reported by Juan Sebastián Muñoz Castillo. The Armero disaster was a tragedy that occurred on November 13 in 1985. Its epicenter was the Nevado del Ruiz volcano and the location that were impacted by the extension radius of the Lajars, were several municipalities of Caldas and Tolima. For the context of the chronology of the tragedy, we find six important moments. One, the groups of volcanologists reported six of the activity to the territorial authorities. Two, the president Belisario Betancourt and the governor of Tolima were put on alert but did not act. Part of the blame was theirs. Three, the explosion of the volcano was accompanied by the formation of lahars due to the mixture of volcanic magma with water, soil sediments, and vegetation. Four, these lahars moved at 16 kilometers per hour, arriving quickly to the municipality that was epicenter of the landslides, Armero, which is located 15 kilometers for the snow capped mountain. Five, Armero was the main affected municipality due to its proximity to the snow covered mountain, but is managed to affect municipalities such as Chinchina and Villa Maria, where rescue efforts saved lives, but the losses were incalculable. Six, since 36 years ago, joint efforts have been made for the recovery of the families and areas that were in pain. New communities have been buoyed on ruins of this shocking event. And continue as for interesting data. It can be said that this tragedy had such an impact on human lives that is estimated that on the total population was reduced by 16%. It went from 20,000 on only 29,000 approximately, uh, 20,000 lows approximately in one month. The most representative case of the tragedy was the gear of Mayra Sanchez. The gear was trapped for three days in the mood. Despite the efforts and rescue attempts, she unfortunately died. Thank you and goodbye.